Hi guys, um, kind of a quick video here. I can't post on my TikTok channel for two days now because somebody decided to mass report me. I don't know why I was mass reported. The video is like three to four months old. I mean, the video was made in November or October, so... There's that. It was one of my vegan teacher videos that was mass reported. Um, one second, I need a drink. So, I'm really getting frustrated. I'm getting so frustrated with how TikTok is. Ever since last year, everything has gotten worse and worse and worse progressively it's like two steps forward three steps back i finally hit 80,000 followers on tiktok something that took me almost two years to do just trying to educate people on who's bad who's good and cosplay and make people happy what is wrong with that what is trying to make people happy? How is that wrong? You know, some days I can't even sit down. Like right now, I am on my bathroom floor in front of right where I take my cosplay videos. It hurts when I can't get into cosplay. That's why I first started talking about like the vegan teacher and TikTok news and everything in the first place because I couldn't move some days. And now those videos that I was making to kind of fill the gap so you guys weren't missing content from me is getting reported. And now I actually do care about what I'm posting and everything else. And it's frustrating. TikTok keeps taking down everyone that needs to stay. The cosplayers especially have been getting hit hard. And they're doing it on purpose, I think. I honestly think that they're doing it on purpose. It's not okay. And like I said, it's two steps forward, three steps back. I keep getting harassed and death threatened by people. I've had countless threats over the course of the last few months. And I never really got them before. It felt like that ever since that last big glitch that happened on TikTok. TikTok keeps keeping all the files, the fists, the, just the awful, awfulest of people, if you know what I mean. You know, you know. So I'm likely going to be posting a lot more on here in the future if my accounts get taken. Um, and I'll do a little changing around and fixing up my channel because it's probably not going to be strictly book content if that does happen. It's probably going to be stuff like this, just talking with you guys, but I really don't not have that much editing skills yet. I mean, this is only my first year on the internet, actually allowed on the internet, because I came from a very sheltered life. Um, I wasn't allowed on the internet, and I'm 24, so very huge learning curves for me to learn all of this. I'm lucky I've gotten to the points that I am. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just letting you all know what's going on. Um, kind of vent a little bit. I'm frustrated. I am so, so beyond frustrated right now. I didn't do anything wrong. And this is my second strike. This is my second post ban in the last month, which lets me know that somebody is horribly mass reporting me. People are like, well, why don't you go private? If I go private, no one can smile at my content. I've tried going private. No one was seeing my videos. In fact, they were getting taken down when I was private, so that didn't help. <laughs> so yeah, just letting you all know what's going on. I'm just beyond frustrated at this point.
I didn't do anything wrong. And I wish that TikTok would just release their moderation guidelines. You know, hey, you say this, do this, it's wrong. But they won't. So. Yeah. Love you all. Hope you have a better day than mine. Bye.